mean, for me, theatre should be about provoking discussion. And I think that comedy is one of the most controversial and exciting ways to provoke that discussion. I mean, there are many, many things you could say about our musical, many things to start debate, to make people upset. But I think it's necessary. I mean, a lot of comedians use that as well. But it's kind of easier for people to walk into what they think, you know, is a, is a light comedy, which is actually a very dark comedy, um, than to go in a, to a serious play, because there are a lot of serious plays about terrorism. How many Jews can you fit in a Volkswagen Beat? No, I do not know. How many Jews can you fit in a Volkswagen Beat? A thousand and four. Two in the front, two in the back, and a thousand in the ashtray. That's a two thousand years of persecution. He'll have to try harder than that, yes? Okay, okay. We had pretty much people walk out every night. But we had 30 American Jewish people in the other day, and they loved it. <laughs> so <laughs> we're getting we're getting the extreme reactions all over. And and also um, Americans have been our best audience as well. They've, yeah. been, they've been the real laugh out loud people. You look in the mirror, tell me what you see. I'm gonna be disappointed if the image isn't me. I became a member of the PFLP, but they threw me off because of jealousy. What a big mistake. This time they come to bar. Don't they realize I'm a Tela superstar? I found in doing the research for them, there are a lot of fascinating stories there for those people. And of course, with Al Qaeda and stuff, we, we don't you know, know those stories yet. Maybe we will in, in 10 years' time, say. And we really wanted to have terrorists that, that joined, that became terrorists for completely different reasons. So we have like a state sponsored terrorist, we have a victim turned terrorist, we have a mercenary, um, we have a race, hate crime. You have to kill to get noticed. You have to kill 